Capricorn, what's up? Welcome to your reading. This is for Capricorn, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. <coughs> Capricorn, for the ones who you're waiting for, the people who, the, who are in no communication and separation, break up, whatever. Well, of course, that's why you're watching the reading. Um, they're coming back around. This person's choosing picking choosing a new direction with you okay they're coming towards you with a new idea about how they can go around with this connection out here they're losing patience so for a lot of you i feel that this has been um it's been a very long time since you guys have been in touch or since you guys have spoken um something has been revealed this person is what i'm getting <laughs> we're gonna find out what um you do know that you're dealing with a control tree, okay? But somewhere, somehow, Capricorn, I also see you as someone who's trying to control the situation because of your own insecurities. I feel for a lot of you, you're not being able to set healthy boundaries out here. You know what you need to do, but you're not putting your foot down yet. You're still letting this person walk away. <clears throat> a lot of you are going, you know, reaching that point of burnout is what I'm getting, okay? Because you guys need to rest. You guys need to either, for, for the ones who are still communicating, you need to cut communication right now, guys. You need time to rest. You need time to recuperate. You need to time to rejuvenate, all right? You need this time to think over, sleep over it. But you're just not doing that. If you're not talking, you're overthinking. You know, you're reaching a point of mental breakdown. Although... Although you see the reality for what it is, you're no longer, you know, like in your dream world anymore. You're no longer just daydreaming and wishful thinking out here. You see the clear picture out here, but you're still choosing to overthink about it. Because you're overthinking, you're not being able to put your foot down. Only if you had control, you know, you would have been, you would have been able to put your foot down. You do see that <laughs> this is a connection that's not offering you stability as of now. And you know that you need to stop thinking about it and keep moving on or you just need to forget about it and let it happen when it happens, okay? But you're not doing that. The worst part is you'll have the realization. The worst part is that you know exactly what's going on. But it's like the acceptance factor is really low out here. Let's see. All right, let's start clarifying the cards. I can give you more information. Clarify the cards, please. Spirit, guys, angels, universe. Let's clarify the cards for Capricorn. Let's clarify the cards for Capricorn. <coughs> So I'm feeling here, uh, for a lot of you here, you probably are not making a choice. So like I said, you have clarity, okay, about the situation out here. And for a lot of you, I feel you're getting closed off to this person. If you're not closed off, this person is being closed off. I'm getting here the way I read the cards out here. I'm going to take this as you. So I feel you are closed off for a lot of you. Okay, maybe you're not very closed off. But the truth is that you guys need to make a choice. You guys need to make a decision out here. Okay, you guys need to communicate your boundaries out here. Some of you are doing it. Some of you aren't. And I think the way you are communicating your boundaries is by staying closed off to this person not responding to this person, not making a decision about this person. So if you for a lot of you, this person, communication is coming in and you're just staying close off because you're like, you know what? No, that's not going to work. That's not going to work. Um, you want to make things, you, you want justice is what I'm getting here. Like I said, you see the reality of the situation. You're trying to make realistic choices out here. And you want justice. You want something to be fair and balanced out here. For a lot of you, you want a marriage, you know, to re be restored. For the others of you, you just want things to get fair. You just want the balance out here. Be it staying in the connection with this person, getting something that you deserve, <coughs> or completely cutting this person off. 
but a lot of you are cutting this person off i feel you're just cutting cords with them okay because you're no longer like i said in that dream world right now no longer fantasizing um i feel that you probably are getting out of that isolation okay some of you are getting most of you are getting out of that isolation period where you chose to you know retreat and where you chose to you know like just stay away and make any decisions about say your career love life finance whatever it is i feel now you're coming into that confident state of mind okay it could have taken a lot of overthinking and mental breakdown but you just reached a point where it's like no i cannot do this anymore so now you're starting to you know uh, rejoin the world slowly get back into the real life get back into the day-to-day -day, uh, world okay i feel for a lot of you you are getting into that single energy where you're very focused on yourself focused on your career focused on your goals you are choosing to probably some of you are choosing to forgive this person because you're focused on your independence in terms of your mind your finances your own growth you're focused on prosperity etc but i feel a lot of you if you were in no communication or forget this is an overall i don't see this is only you uh not wanting to communicate with this person but for a lot of you here even if you're not just, just staying very aloof, okay, from the world or your friends, family, you're, you're snapping out of it very slowly but steadily in a way where you're choosing to forgive this person, putting the past in the past out here and just cutting calls with this person. <clears throat> you know that you were dealing with someone out here who was not offering you stability out here. There was no security in the connection. There was no structure out here and it broke your heart, but you're just finally trying to release and forgive this person and move on and move towards something better now this person out here they know that uh, you know you're dealing with someone out here who probably holds a grudge against you okay for cutting them off for your own good okay <laughs> yeah actually that's what i said they're holding a grudge against you for cutting them out because it was good for you they're coming back around here all right but again for the ones who want um or waiting for this person to come towards you with a clear solution they're not they're looking for a quick fix they're looking for a quick fix. They're not trusting that intuition. They're just wanting to, you know, um, uh, they, they, they're releasing their fears, okay? So that fear which is holding this person back all this while to communicate with you, to reach out to you, it's like, you know what, I'm fed up, okay? Now, there is no communication between me and Capricorn. Capricorn's not making a move, so I'm just going to make a move and I'm going to go ahead and let Capricorn know that, whatever i miss you or i like you or let's just talk again okay let's just get back on talking terms at least they're coming towards you with that very light-hearted energy okay so keep that in mind this is not someone here who's committal this is someone here who uh has a lot of passion for you okay they're coming towards you with that adventurous energy okay where they um they know what they're looking for, okay? They have a clear direction out here. But again, this is not the best card, I'd say, for someone here who you're looking for a commitment with or who you're looking for, okay, now things will get fine. No, I don't think so. I feel this person out here is finally taking that execution in their hand. But still, I'd say that this person out here has a tendency to get bored very fast, okay? If you're married to this person out here, they want to start talking to you. If you're not married to this person, you want commitment. The commitment, I still don't see on the charts out here, but they still at least want to start, break the ice out here with you. But again, they're looking for a quick fix, okay? Their, they, their, their agenda is more like to push you. No, talk to me, talk to me, talk to me. Let's talk, let's talk, let's talk, okay? But they're no longer wanting to wait for the right time okay because it's just getting too much the waiting period is stressing them out out here so they're coming back around out here but overall i think you're gonna cut this person off honestly you're gonna cut this person off <coughs> you're just not you're just gonna be closed off to this person's even the slightest communication out here i feel this person here can make things happen with you they can start and uh, set things right they can come they want to come right towards you but they're not doing it for some reason out here i feel this person lacks confidence okay and they're holding back <clears throat> they're holding back from giving you what you really want so i feel they're testing you is the door still open for them to come back towards you and just waltz back into your life and then it's like they can leave when they want to or are you shutting the doors pretty damn closed are you slamming the door on their face and they literally will need to break the door in order for them to get inside i think they're just testing the waters like let me try this one more time once again let's try maybe is capricorn you know going to entertain my bullshit let me push the boundaries one more time and see if capricorn lets me get their way you're moving on is what i'm getting you've thrown in the towel 
you you throw in the towel and you're like I, i i just can't do this i feel you're wanting to move on to better things you're just moving on you're no longer in that place where there was a lot of regret you're no longer wanting to cry with spilled milk you're like it is what it is maybe there's more there's more fish in the sea and you want to go around and see that the grass is greener on the better better on the other side okay the grass is greener on the other side is what i mean so yeah you're moving on to better things in life okay you can't you have no energy you have no strength you have no willpower and no determination to hold on to this connection which you have tried to make work out over and over and over and over again in hopes that this person will change and come back around the right way they're feeling guilty they're coming back around like i said but <clears throat> you're no longer investing there is no investment from your side capricorn this time around here no investment <clears throat> i feel you are uh, being very selfish in a good way okay it's like you're making yourself a priority this time around here you know you're making yourself a priority here no longer wanting to nurture a kid anymore okay no longer wanting to you know nurture a man child or a woman child is what i'm getting you want me you stand up for yourself and you give me what i deserve and you give us what we need to make this relationship stable you want to come back around with that lame ass energy of hey hey what's up and i miss you i love you let's catch up blah 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 let's date no, no. you're not going to be happy with that capricorn so it's like a blunt straight flat out blocking or a straight big fucking no from your side but they're coming back around they're coming back around for sure okay so um like i said they're coming back with a grudge guys they're very upset they're very pissed off and very upset that you, how is it that you didn't even get back to them so for a lot of you if you're holding back communication from them for a very long time this person's like whoa the capricorn just ghost me the capricorn doesn't even care capricorn doesn't give a shit where is my magic my magic isn't working with capricorn anymore maybe i need to go back and you know get that to move a little faster they want their magic to work their magic isn't working on you anymore it's not cuz you're just doing you okay so <coughs> god my throat so that's what i have for you guys hope this reading resonates do leave your comments below like share subscribe and i will see you next time bye bye